So today we're at Moor End Road and we're looking at this uh, lovely little two bedroom cottage. It's a through by light and we'll take you around. Uh, before we start inside, I'll just show you the outside. Uh, you've got an entrance porch here, it's really useful when you come in. And then to the front of the house, you've got a nice seating area. Just here. We're in a semi rural location. You've got fields out to the front and then when you step in obviously you're into your living room uh, these stairs obviously take you upstairs to the two bedrooms uh, but downstairs at the moment we are in the living room so in the living room you can see we've got central heating uh, double glazing now because uh, it's through by light we do have windows to two aspects so you've got plenty of natural light coming through. Um, this is a gas fire. So it's a nice feature to the room. I'll have another central heating radiator there. And to the rear, you've got views over the Pennine Hills. So nice views out that way. You've got a kitchen. Uh, it's, it's a nice fitted kitchen. Uh, it's compact, um, but it's ideal you know, just for, if there's just one or two of you. And you've got an oven, obviously. And then we've got a door here, which actually takes you down to the uh, cellar. Now you've got a fridge freezer built in there, by the way. I'll take you down to the cellar now. So, just go down here carefully, because uh, headroom is a bit tight. People were a bit shorter back in the day. So, in the cellar here, Obviously got all the utilities and got space here. This I will say this is a utility area because you can put your washing machine, plumb that in downstairs. That's obviously the combi boiler, runs your heating and hot water. Uh, if you have a push bike, you can put that down here. And you've got your electrics and gas meter, and a little room in here. Nice place to store wine as well. I'll take you back upstairs. So, say so you've got your gas hob there, and uh, just doing a bit of cleaning there, but you've got your, your sink and your drainer. So, from here, obviously, you have your TV points over there. And we'll take you upstairs. So it is a double and a single room. Uh, the owner's just doing a bit of painting up here at the moment. But this is your landing area. Uh, if we go straight into the bathroom first, you can see you've got a sink, WC and a bath. You've got a mixer shower over the bath, your shower curtain, got a mirrored cabinet. So it's a nice and light bathroom and this is your main bedroom it's a double room it's a good size um, the lens does make rooms look a bit smaller than what they are but it is a, a nice du double room is this you can see the uh, views to the front as well so you're definitely in a semi-rural location here and the second room is a single ideally you know probably used as a home office you can get a single bed in here some of this furniture you could actually put in the main bedroom so you could put a single bed in here if you wanted for example or uh, quite often now people are looking for a home office so this would make a nice home office you have your desk here and then you're overlooking the hillsides so a nice place to work with that okay so just to summarize from this landing area you've got your two bedrooms double and a single and then you've got your bathroom. And then when we go back downstairs, you've got a nice living room, dual aspect, windows both sides, central heating, double glazing, feature fireplace, and obviously your kitchen, which leads down to that useful cellar as well. So if you are interested in this property, just give the team at Peter David a call. We'll make the necessary arrangements to meet you and show you around. Thank you.